tips from Todd here at the Wisconsin CTC. Talk to you today about the executive summary that you should send off to your program officers. Now, the NSF actually has a project pitch which acts as an executive summary. We recommend that you always prepare and send off an executive summary to the, to the program officer uh, before you actually figure out if you're going to prepare a, a proposal. Now, the pr executive summary will help clarify in the program officer's mind what your project is, and we actually would like you to send it to us, too, so we can look it over and help you out. It clarifies, in my mind, what your project is actually going to do, what the problem is, and uh, what your solution might be. Interestingly, though, if you haven't prepared an executive summary, when you do, you'll find that it actually clarifies in your mind, too, what your project really should be. Now, the executive summary should describe the overall problem that you're trying to solve. You should talk a little bit about the competing technologies that are out there and how they fail. And then you should talk a little about your technology, followed by some specific aims or technical objectives you would like to try to, to solve. The last paragraph, or the last part of the executive summary, you can talk a little bit about how you plan on commercializing things or what you plan on doing in phase two. This has been Tips from Todd, Wisconsin CTC, here for all your SBIR needs.